Phoenix Wright here. And what on earth is this? That's right, Ace Attorney TV. My friend Miles Edgeworth and I are here today to tell you all about the amazing series we star in, Ace Attorney. All I want to know is what you've dragged me into this time, right? Well, I was told to share what makes this series so special, but I didn't want to do it all by my lonesome, so... <sighs> the first Ace Attorney game follows the trials of rookie defense attorney Phoenix Wright as he tackles a string of difficult cases. This courtroom battle adventure was initially released on October 12, 2001. That was more than 20 years ago. Back then, no one had even heard of the courtroom battle genre. I had to fight fiercely for my clients by presenting evidence against the witnesses' lies. OBJECTION! Just like that! And yet, the only reward that was thrown your way was a face full of hair. You really didn't need to remind me. But it felt so good when I turned my thinking around, found the contradictions, and trounced that annoying prosecutor. Another thing this series is known for is its cast of colorful characters. That's right! So now let's take a look back at the entire Ace Attorney series and the weirdos from each one! That's right! Ace Attorney TV! Starting from the very beginning, it's Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trilogy! And who was the weirdo of the first Ace Attorney game? Edgeworth! It's you! It's definitely you! Me? In what way am I a weirdo? Let's see, you objected to a witness's talkativeness? Well, I mean, sh shouldn't that imply that it's the witness who is the weirdo here? Anyway, let's move on. In the second game, Justice for All, we meet Manfred von Karma's daughter, Francisca von Karma. Yeah, she sure loved to crack her beloved whip at me. And boy, did it hurt! The third game, Trials and Tribulations, gave us the mysterious masked prosecutor, Godot. Yeah, he sure loved to throw his beloved special blend of coffee at me, and boy was it hot! It does warn you right on the box, right? Maybe you should learn a few special moves of your own, too. Is that really what they mean by courtroom battle? And that's Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trilogy in a nutshell! Three monumental games of the mystery adventure genre that laid the foundation of this series together in one timeless collection! That's right! Ace Attorney TV! Next in the lineup, Apollo Justice Ace Attorney Trilogy. Rookie attorney Apollo Justice makes his debut here as a brand new protagonist for the series. Tough new cases put all of his knowledge and skills to the test as he comes into his own. If memory serves, Mr. Justice's rival is Clavier Gavin. He's a district prosecutor and the leader of the rock band Gaviners. The sound of his air guitar playing leaves quite the impression during his trials. Hold it! The sound of his air guitar is a clear contradiction. You think I don't know that? The fifth game, Dual Destinies, introduces rookie lawyer Athena Sykes to the series. Her expertise in psychology helps her get to the truth. Death Row inmate and prosecutor Simon Blackwell also debuts. Yeah, he sure loved to slice off my beloved front spike, didn't he? The sixth game, Spirit of Justice, features the Kingdom of Crime, where spirit mediums call upon the memories of the dead as a method of cornering defendants. It also features international prosecutor and Kura Eni's monk, Nayuta Sadmahi. Yeah, he sure loved to use his beads to seal my beloved objection arm. I wonder if I should learn a secret move or two myself. I really don't think that's what they mean by courtroom battle. These three titles showcase the evolution of Ace Attorney, truly. It's a collection packed with justice. That's right, Ace Attorney TV. Next, we have The Great Ace Attorney Chronicles, a collection of two fantastic games. Led by Phoenix Wright's ancestor, Ryunosuke Naruhodo, it is set in Victorian London and Meiji, Japan. Ryunosuke teams up with that great detective of fame, Mr. Herlock Sholmes, as they dancingly deduce their way through London. Standing in their way is a man known as the Reaper, the legendary prosecutor Barack Van Zeeks. Hmm. Well, I still got more ruffles than him, though. So you think that makes you better? Courtroom trials in the Old Bailey were also unique for their use of a jury system. Like the great detective stories of old, this great duology features the greatest turnabouts of all time. That's right! Ace Attorney TV! Next is the mystery masterpiece, Ghost Trick Phantom Detective. 
What's special about this stylish title is that, unlike Ace Attorney games with their individual episodes, Ghost Trick focuses on only one grand story. When you start the game, the main character, Sissel, is already dead. And someone has killed the heroine, Lynn, as well. Yes, it's curtains for everyone. Except, having become a spirit, Sissel can now rewind time, jump into objects and manipulate them, all to undo a person's untimely demise. So, just as I turn my thinking around in court, Sissel turns back time to avert fate. It's a change of pace from Ace Attorney, but why not check out Ghost Trick Phantom Detective 2? That's right! Ace Attorney TV! I think that about covers everything and then some. Hold it! Let's not forget the Ace Attorney Investigations Collection. Well, look at you, Mr. Influencer. I mean, since I'm here, we might as well cover it. This collection contains the two Ace Attorney Investigations games. They star me, Miles Edgeworth. I pursue the truth, not as a defense attorney, but as a prosecutor, in this new style of Ace Attorney game. Yeah, and where all of your rivals in the investigation series are just as weird as you. <laughs> Interpol investigator Shi Long Lang hates it when prosecutors get in his hair, which must be all the time for Mr. Werewolf. Agent Lang is admired by his many subordinates, right? So I suggest you watch what you say. And what if I don't? In the second game, a judge and committee for prosecutorial excellence member, Verity Gavell, stands in Edgeworth's way. She overrules people with her extendable gavel. I wonder if she uses that thing in court, too. Same, me too. Get to know me, Miles Edgeworth, better as you investigate behind the crime scene tape in my series. That's right, Ace Attorney TV. Looking back on the series makes you realize just how much Ace Attorney has going on. Indeed. And should any of the weirdos or stories pique your interest, why not check them out? But is it okay to just jump in with, say, Apollo Justice Ace Attorney Trilogy or The Great Ace Attorney Chronicles? I don't remember what happened in the second game, you see. It was like I was hit on the head or something and forgot everything. Oh, right. You of all people. Every title we've showcased today is entirely self-contained, so it's perfectly fine to start from whichever one you'd like. No way! And that about wraps it up for us. Now, subscribe or face our... OBJECTION! Thanks a bunch, Edgeworth. I couldn't have done this without you. And what about next time? Uh, uh, next time? How about a rundown of the top three episodes of uh. The Steel Samurai, Warrior of Neo Old Tokyo? No, wait. We could also cover the Pink Princess's top three episodes.